Sit you guys on. I had a second interview with uh, the law firm that I was really excited to interview for, and I did a personality test um, for them. But I was trying to weigh, I think they're going to offer me the position, and I think it's going to be at the rate of pay that I requested, which would be awesome. Um. <laughs> So here's the thing, um, I'm trying to make the decision, I've talked with friends and family, a friend and family at this point, and um, I don't know, <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. Um, there are some pretty big, uh, there are some significant differences in both of them as far as structure um, which is really important to me um, workload which is also important to me because I want to um, I don't want to be overworked you know what I mean I want it to be a good workload I don't want to just be sitting there doing nothing but I do um, want to even steady workload. I don't want to be overworked and overwhelmed. Um, community, which is something that's important to me because I've already been at a job where there was no community, there was no help, there was no anything. And I absolutely, like this past five years, like I've dreaded going to work. Not every day, but for more, more days I've dreaded going to work than I'm just like excited to get there. And that's what I'm trying to avoid. I don't want to work at a place where I don't want to be. Um, so yeah, benefits of course. Um, but it's, it's crazy. Like it's been like, it's been crazy. So I don't know, man. I'm just um, trying to make a decision. So I'll, I should know by Friday if I got this job or not I already have one job offer on the table and I will take it if this one falls through but after going to that second interview I really just feel like man I would really enjoy working here I don't want to set any expectations because I've been doing that with the with these other interviews and I'm looking up instead of here oh, so I've been doing that with these other interviews and it has not gone well like I've not gotten the job so I went in this one, you know, with no expectations, not low or high, just none, because you never know. Um, and there are a lot of good candidates out there. So, yeah, finding a job is crazy, um, especially changing whole career fields. It's wild. So that's, I don't know. I'm praying and seeking the Lord on this one because I really don't know. Um, so I'm so tired you guys like I'm tired <laughs> the job hunt is tough out here and I now have a whole nother degree and it's still tough out here so um but I've been getting some good feedback at least and um yeah so yeah I'm excited and I'm excited so I'll update you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, welcome back to Plus Girl Slay, the channel, paralegal series. And y'all know why this camera is on. Another interview today. They actually called me yesterday. They sent me a message on Indeed to see if I was interested. I said that I am interested. Um, so I'm getting ready. The interview is at 11.30 a.m. It is 9.50 a.m. I just got done prepping my hair I just got to put my bun in um, I actually had to decline a job because after meeting with the supervising attorney and the other attorney in the office I just felt like my personality would not mesh well with the other um, supervising attorney but I did not know how to say that to her um, and she got very nasty in my opinion when I declined the offer 
um, very crass, very rude, very nasty. So I just felt like, whoo, girl, you done dodged a bullet because I have already done the condescending entitlement of a manager kind of deal. Not going to do it again. So, yeah. I'm trying to set you guys down. Um, this is a weird angle. Sorry, you guys. Um, so yeah, I actually went ahead and declined. This is such a weird angle. I declined that offer and I feel like so much better about it. Um, because like I said, it just, no, 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 no. So yeah, um, the, jo the one that I did really like, I have not heard back from them. So <clears throat> it's been like, I interviewed on the 4th. I had a second interview on the 19th. I don't know, like holiday time and all that good stuff. But I was supposed to hear something back on the 20th. So I'm assuming that because I didn't, it means that I didn't get it. So I'm going to go ahead and keep searching, keep pursuing other things. And... Um, yeah, it's just been, this, finding a job has been, man, it's been a roller coaster ride. And it's just like, I, this is, I remember this. I remember how all of this felt, but it's just like, I'm coming out of college now, um, with, I, with, with what I thought was realistic expectations of pay for the degree that I have, but it's not like reality, which is what I'm running into now. Um which is what I'm running into now, which is just like, man, bruh. So yeah, I'm gonna keep praying about it, keep searching, um, continue to be consistent, continue to be of a positive attitude and keep it pushing. But I just wanted to kind of update you guys on that. I will see you guys um, either before or after the interview, not sure. But again, this one is with another law office um, and it's in about an hour and a half. So I need to go ahead and get my face on and get my clothes on and I will talk with you guys soon. Bye. So I am just taking my jacket off. Um, I did interview. The interview went well. I got the job. Um, I start next Friday. Um, the pay is not what I wanted, but oh gosh, <laughs> and that's the only problem is the pay. Um, the pay is not what I wanted, but everything else is cool. Like everything else is. The training, the there's no health insurance, which sucks, but that's not uncommon for small practices. Um, not uncommon at all. So, whoa, two. So let me tell you, um, the interview went well. It was like I'm about to eat real quick, y'all, because I'm hungry. I have not eaten all day, and I already had my mac and cheese. I'm having Chick-fil-A, right? Uh, yeah, the work environment seemed pretty nice. Um, it's very small, like, there's one other paralegal. I'm like, that's it. Like, <laughs> And then the attorneys, that's it. So, if they did have benefits, It would be very expensive because they don't have a group. They have a group plan, you know. But my mom was like, you don't have to be married to that job. But I just know me. Like, I know that I'll get somewhere and grow. I got a job. <laughs> I'm blowed. Like, I got the job.